Persistent vomiting and diarrhea can result in intravascular fluid depletion with hypertension and tachycardia. Hypervolumic shock with vascular collapse and oliguric renal failure may occur in severe cases. In, if vomiting is the main cause of fluid loss, metabolic alkalosis with hypo, hypochloremia can occur. If diarrhea is more prominent, metabolic acidosis is more likely. Both vomiting and diarrhea can cause hypokalemia. Hyponatremia may develop particularly if hypertoxic fluids are used in replacement therapy. In viral infections, watery diarrhea is the most common symptom. Stools rarely contain mucus or blood.